Watch as this nurse details her horrific experience with the coronavirus. My people, citizens of Mobile, Alabama, it is for real out here. When I say it's for real, it's for real. People is dying, dropping like flies. That lie they telling about old people and all that, no ma'am, no sir. Young people, 30 year olds, 20 year olds, 19 year olds. I just was in the ED and we intubated four people within 30 minutes. We had a gunshot victim today who came in the hospital and she was on quarantine. She had um, tested positive and was home on quarantine and got shot. This is crazy. Everybody got it. We can't go out the door, period. We can't go outside. It's so for real, y'all. The TV, you say how do you think they scare you? The TV ain't serving this shit. No justice. The PPE. They got PPE, but if every patient is positive and having symptoms, what are we supposed to do? We walking around now with gowns on from head to toe. Everybody funky, musty, sweaty. We got gowns on, we got hoodies on, we got glasses on, we got masks on all day long. And the crazy part is, you know, people saying, oh, y'all need to come home. Y'all should just come home, money, and everything. We can't even come home. Because now we've been exposed, so now we have to quarantine for 14 days. So if I got to be here for 14 days, anyway, I might as well come to work. So don't say, like, why you ain't coming home? Because I can't. It's the same thing. Whether I sit in the hotel room or whether I go to work. Everybody got this shit. Somebody can go to go to work and pass by me, and I'm going to have it. You feel what I'm saying? I ain't got no PPE on in the hotel. It's just that serious, y'all. Please don't take it lightly. Please don't be at your house partying and kicking it how we was because we ain't know. It's for real. Y'all, this message is not to scare nobody. I just want people to be aware because before we went into those hospitals, we was in here kicking it. We was having a good time. We was partying. We was walking to Target. We was walking to get something to eat. So we went inside that hospital, y'all. It, it is so sad. Like, nurses crying, people packing up and leaving. It is devastating. It is some stuff that you see on TV. Like, people dying, and they just putting a sheet over them, working on the next patient. Patients who need to be in the hospital for other things other than the um, corona. They can't come to the hospital because the corona got it sold up. It's like a real epidemic, a real pandemic, just like they say. The news is not doing this any justice. Like, they need to take the camera and go in the hospital so y'all can really understand. And y'all won't be worried about school or nothing else.